All right, welcome to RichardBankerWebDesign.com. Today we're looking at the Joomla 2.5 article manager. And we're going to start from this screen because this is where you'll log in from. Heading up top, you'll see your content in your article manager here. Clicking on it will, as you expect, open it up. Now we're going to go through all of this here. Uh, we'll start with the title here. If you click on the title of your article, it will actually open the article for editing. Underneath is the alias. This is what shows up if you have your search engine friendly URLs enabled. This is what will show up for that article. Your status is if it's published. If you click on that green arrow, it will turn to a red circle, which means that it's unpublished. And clicking on it again will publish it. You can also feature an article. Now depending on how your website is set up and if you're using featured articles it works the same way just by clicking on it will feature an article. Sometimes I designs websites and uh, we use the featured function for a number of different things. Uh, displaying different articles on the front page it allows them to add and take away articles as they want. Uh, the category if it's if it's got uh, in a specific category, it, it'll be mentioned there. Uh, the ordering of the article, where it fits in, the uh, public, whether the access is public, you can set it to public, registered, or special. <clears throat> I'll cover that later. Uh, who it was created by, the date it was created, how many hits it's got so far. So if you're curious about a particular article, you want to come back here and say, hey, you know, how many hits is this article getting? Oh my word, it's off the charts. It's got two or 2,000 or whatever it is. Uh, if it's in a specific language and then the actual article ID. Also across the top here, you've got a whole bunch of different options. You can create a new article, you can click on an article and hit edit, Hit. you can publish and unpublish or a feature from up top here. You can also archive an article and put it into archive mode. Uh, you can check in an article. So if you're going to be editing it and you don't want anyone else to be able to get in and edit it at the same time, you can by default it checks it in anyways but you can check it in if you're like okay I need to edit this article this article this article I'll check them in and then I'll be able to go in and make my changes uh, you can trash an article and there's also an options button up here the options button will go over in a little bit that's your quick overview of you know hey what am I looking at in the article manager have any questions head over to richardbankerwebdesign.com Hit us up on the help forum. We'd be glad to help.